Hello everybody and welcome back finally to another episode of the uh, sea Operation Sea Line Achievement Run. Uh, I, just literally just following off from where I left off uh, because it's been so long since I've actually been had a chance to sit down and record this series for you. Uh, I've had to actually go through and do it all again so if things are a little bit different from last time I do apologise. I'm doing my best to try and get things back in order. Uh, speaking of order, I am building my Panzer Divisions just so we can absolutely steamroll uh, the Netherlands, Belgium, and of course, France. So hopefully, fingers crossed, things will start to go plan. Uh, st sorry, start to go as planned. I am trying to get out more infantry divisions just in case because you never, 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 never know. Armored Spearhead's 15 days away. This is right around the corner. So debt and land, we're looking at 40 days away. Things are moving quite swiftly. However, Poland is going to be a problem. I feel like I've left Poland a tad too long. Uh, instead of sort of going for Poland, I was doing sort of all of this stuff instead. So I'm probably going to reassert Eastern Claims next, Danzig or War, and then deal with the Poles. And then after that, the lovely French. So fingers crossed, things go through just as planned. Radio, it's time to see... Yeah, there we go. I was about to say, it's time to see if the Czechs will fold. And indeed, they have. Historical day for Germany. Now it's time to reassert those Eastern Claims. Um, I also, oh, the government uh, government idea, Hjalshat, I have no idea, and I don't remember what the hell Hjalshat was. Also, I still have Mipho bills, so before they go out, it's probably best to do them on time. Ah, uh, that was a close call. <laughs> cut it, I cut it quite lucky, cut it quite, uh, quite, quite lucky. Uh, I just need to keep, keep going along as I do. I've got all my speed guys in place for this. Um, it's just a matter of getting things done now. I do have my armored core here. I do want to get another armored core just in case, just for backup, because you can never be too certain. You can never be too sure. Um, so the plan is, I don't know how I'm going to do against the Soviets, though. That's my main concern. Um, but the glory of this playthrough is it's strictly for Operation Sea line So as long as I get the achievement, everything's fine and dandy because I haven't got to deal with the Soviets. That's that's a blessing in disguise. <laughs> But let's get these uh, last of the infantry divisions out. Uh, I am running quite low on manpower, which is not ideal. I'm going to chuck them over here, give them to George von Kukla, like so. And you can go and pressure the Czechs. Happy days. Right, okay, well, I'll see you when it's time for Danzig or war, because we both know that the Poles aren't going to give it up. So, two fun things, really, to note. One, uh, Poland refused, as we imagined would be the case. And two... I've only just noticed until now that I've had the music turned off. So apologies for that. Um, I'll be working on that right away. Uh, having that turned on, as you can hear in the background now. Uh, Poland gains conquer war goal. Okay, right, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Extra research slot, that would be very helpful right about now. Let's get the uh, light tanks sent over. They are absolutely rapid. So that is exactly what we've been needing. They are rerouting a load of troops. Uh, so going to declare war. They are guaranteed by France and the UK. Um, hmm, it's going to be a tough one. It's going to be a tough one. So what I'm going to do is you guys here, I'm actually going to use you for backup on the Magino right here, like so. There we go. Send them over. Any chance of you joining in? Any chance of you joining in? Hopefully not. Hopefully not. It should be fair game. It should be fair game because I've left it quite late. This is kind of bitting me in the butt cheeks, but, uh, Oh, here we go. <laughs> there we go. All's fair in love and war. Supposedly it is, at least. Uh, you're fine. I'm not pressing your buttons. I'm. There we go. So you're in game. You're in game. You're in game. Uh, I think that's everyone. Go apart from Romboy. There we go. Activate Romboy. Get Romy Rom in the mix. There we go. Italian volunteers. That's what I've been needing. Oh my god, look at how much fuel the bloody tanks are chewing out of me. This is awful. Absolutely awful. God, just hold the line, hold the line, hold the line. This is, um, I'm going to be honest, this is not what I prepared for. I did not prepare for this in the slightest. This is not how things went about in the first run. I will be honest with you. I'm not, I wasn't expecting this. Poland was supposed to come a lot earlier. And it shows. Oh boy, does it show. <laughs> right, guys. Uh, so I'm actually going to take this opportunity as an opportunity to show you what not to do. Do not leave Poland so late on uh, to the point of where this happens. Because I've ended up screwing myself because I'm rushing through this playthrough. So you know what? I'm not going to cheese it. And I'm not going to give you something half-assed. 
I'm going to quickly make a cut. And I'll see you guys back in a minute. At a decent point in time. Where we're good to go. And uh, Poland's not a problem. I'll be, I'll be back in a moment. Hopefully by 38. Things will be looking better. Okay. I, I'm going to show you how to do it right. <laughs> you know guys. So I've gone back to it. And we're about to start the Poland War again. And it doesn't matter what I do. Something always seems to go wrong. I mean. UK have decided that in this run they want to go communist uh also what has happened is czechoslovakia refused to sue Zetterland and they're in a faction with france and they have yugoslavia and the republic of hungary because france declared war on hungary and these two squished them and they are now a puppet of czechoslovakia so it doesn't matter what i do Something always seems to go wrong, and I don't know how to combat this. It's just, I'm just bad luck Anglo. That might as well be my name at this point, bad luck Anglo. I'm going to try and see what I can do with this run. Hopefully we can complete the series and turn it into an achievement complete run. Uh, but this is just a nightmare. Like, legitimately, this is a nightmare. This is awful. Uh, everything could have gone right, but chose not to. I think next time I probably need to uh, sort of click on... Uh, Historical accuracy activate that that's kind of the whole spiel that I'm probably going to be needing to do uh, Have I got enough? I still don't have enough manpower out there. Are you kidding me? I need to kill the poles and I'm going insane with the fact of I can't kill the poles uh, Can we pop up like so like so like so just give me one Armored core that'd be nice. Give me also another infantry division like so Fantastic. Bearing in mind, we don't want to lose all of our manpower all at once. Let me go repay the Mepho bills. There we go. Oh, God. I don't know how this one's going to go down. I think this is going to be a failure again. I'm going to be 110% honest with you. I do not think this is going to go well for me in any way, shape, or form. But there's only one way to find out, and that's by having my booty handed to me. So I suppose I will see you when that's the case. Okie dokie guys, here we go, right, we're finally at war now with the Poles, funnily enough they were going right, they're guaranteed by the Romanians, which means we're going to be at war with them as well, I will be taking their land stri like, strictly for the oil, uh, I've also got guys here who I have said to attack, but they've got no, uh, well, literally no, 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 no go juice at all, so we're going to do that and get everyone involved, there's loads of green pips, I do like to see green pips, Green pips are bloody good. Happy days. Now I'm going to take the mickey. And I'm going to bring in these guys. And I'm going to get them to go. The second they're on that border, I am having them advance. Let's try and see this lightning speed. There we go. Order's been given. Let's see how quickly they can move. Oh my lord. Yowza. Impressive. Impressive. They're pushing into Warsaw. They'll be done fairly soon, one would hope. I want you guys to sort of move along the south like that because we do need to get stuck into Romania. But I think that's Poland sort of dealt with now. that We've actually gone through Poland quite quickly this time around. Thankfully. Jesus. Took long enough. <laughs> but uh, around the Maginot is about to happen. Uh, Netherlands has rejected a compliance. That's good stuff, right? Okay, war with France. The only tricky part with this is we're going to have to be prepared for Czechoslovakia, Hungary, and Yugoslavia. Because uh, we are not prepared in the slightest. So it means France is going to have to be a quick job. Um, and fingers crossed, it is exactly that. A nice, quick job. I also need manpower. Which means the next about 150 we get is going to get put into this uh, extensive conscription. Just so we do have that extra oomph in the push of things. And you guys, I want you to go to Radom like that. And absolutely blitz your way through. There we go. I want to see speed. Give me speed. Warsaw has fallen. Is there anything else that needs to fall? Grodno. Grodno should be easy enough. No? And I've just noticed my, my tanks are awful. Is it because they are light tanks? What's wrong with my format? Everything should be fine with my format. You know what? I think I need to revisit this. Something's telling me there's a slight chance I might need to revisit this. Oh, dearie me. Unless they patched it. Unless they patched this idea. There we go. Give me all the mediums. I need all the mediums. Dearie me. 
There we go, there we go. Finally managed to get the poles to cap. I will be taking all of that, thank you. It just means I need to now get in and uh, sort of finish off the Romanians. I don't want to do that. I want you guys to do that. I actually want to see how many they've got. Uh, it should be okay. Again, key terminology here should be. Uh, I also want to get you guys lined up like that. You help out. I also want you guys to go like this on the checks. I really do wish the checks never got involved. It just makes things so much more harder now. Like so. And then you guys down here like that. Happy days. I want you to get rolling, you to get rolling. Push everything else. Hopefully we've got enough oomph to spank them. Probably not. Gonna be honest. Actually, no. No, no, no. It looks like we can do it. It looks like we can do it. But we will be doing it next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys. If you have enjoyed, don't forget to, of course, click that like button and or subscribe. Share me friends and group for the channel. And I'll see you in the next episode. Ta-da!